Hello everyone, today I want to talk to you about sharing color work between After Effects and DaVinci Resolve. Not only are a lot of Adobe users switching over to Resolve for their color correction and even basic editing, After Effects was also missing the feature of the ability to export LUTs out of the program, which you can now do. So today I want to show you my cool new plugin that takes all of the color correction applied to your layer, and once you go to Layer, Export LUT allows you to instantly create an accurate LUT, which we can then send over to Resolve and continue modifying our color work in a more advanced way. Before we get started, make sure you check out the link in the description to see Layer LUT Exporter, which is the name of this awesome plugin. You can browse the page and go ahead and purchase it if you'd like to support me or just have this increased capability inside of After Effects. So once you've installed the plugin, you can go ahead and bring in a piece of footage and now we just want to color correct it or assuming you already have a clip or a layer that's color corrected to your needs. So I'll just throw on a couple of color correction effects here and modify this uh, video of a wintry forest. I'm gonna maybe bring up the highlights uh, in terms of tinting. Go ahead and maybe give it a little bit of green and blue just to give it some color depth, looks good. And then I'm gonna also mess around here with the gamma give it some contrast, and then just boost the exposure back up. Now this is quite a bright image, which is fine. Uh, we're just gonna be using this as an example now that we can translate over to Resolve. So again, all we need to do to export this LUT super fast, super accurate, is make sure we have our layer selected with all of our new color correction effects. Go to Layer, Export LUT. You want to select a location to save your LUT and then call it something. We'll just call this Forest LUT, or maybe we can call it winter forest LUT, hit save. And literally in just a couple seconds, you can see it closed the window uh, to bring up the last window that appeared. That's just a effect of it because what it also did was loaded up uh, the folder where it was saved to. And as you can see, that went by super fast. I have a previous LUT I worked on here and here is our new LUT. Now, if we wanted to recreate this inside of DaVinci Resolve, I'm gonna go and import my forest footage. I'm going to drop it into a timeline here. And we'll want to go over to the Fusion tab where we can apply LUTs and effects. I'll right click, click on Add a Tool, go to the LUT section, and choose a File LUT because we have a LUT file or a cube file. And we'll link up the media in with the LUT file and then set it to Out. As you can see, that makes no change. But now, when we go up here to browse for our LUT file that we just exported, we'll select our Winter Forest LUT and boom, just like that, we have our LUT applied inside of Resolve. So whether or not you need this to essentially uh, just recreate the original footage inside of DaVinci Resolve after After Effects, that's one use case. Another use case is to just have this on file if you need to then further color correct other scenes with this and all you have are After Effects effects applied. Export as a LUT, it makes it much easier to work with in Resolve in After Effects even, and in Premiere if you use that as well. But overall, that's how you can take a color correction from After Effects and move it over to DaVinci Resolve, and then continue working on your project in Resolve, do further work on the color correction or whatever else you need to do. And again, this is all thanks to my new plugin, Layer LUT Exporter, which is a missing feature in After Effects now available to quickly and accurately export a LUT from After Effects directly by simply selecting a layer with some effects applied, going to the layer menu, selecting export LUT, and within just a few seconds, you'll have an accurate LUT file to use in DaVinci Resolve or any other program or workflow you need. Thanks for watching. Again, check out the link in the description for the product, and we'll see you next time.